Hey, social care! I'm going on my second date with Paul tonight. I was in the barn and sitting there and all of a sudden, red solo cup, you fill me up, let's have a party. Yeah, well, that's his uh, ringtone. Because <laughs> I had so much fun with him when we went out last week and he's just a really busy man. So we're going out again tonight to Miguel Cuddy's in New Paul. It's one of my favorite places. It's where Louisa and Mary and Sandra and all of us went that night. And um, we had a really good time there. I have a good time every time I go in there. So, And I have a better time than I'm with Paul. So I didn't think he was going to call me back, but I guess he liked me. He called me back. <laughs> Tanner's upstairs moping, as usual. Because he knows I'm going out. Oh well, you know, I have to live. I can't just live for the tan man. Mama's got to live. <laughs> anyway, I want to say happy birthday to Dylan, Jennifer's son, that's Little Red Rodden Hood. All right, so go check him out. Wish him a happy birthday, everybody. He's adorable. He's 13 today. And um, yay, happy birthday. So. Okay, so I'm gonna go out and I'll let y'all know. Maybe I can sneak a video in of him. I don't know, because I think that was uh, bad luck with Jerry. <laughs> I don't know, but anyway, you guys, I love you all very, very, very much, and um, I will talk to y'all later, I hope. So, like I said, I'll try and sneak in a video. I don't know, and I'll show you what I'm wearing. What the hell, right? Oh, I don't know. Nothing special. Just this little sweater, my little boots, and that's it. Straighten my hair, all that good shit. So, whatever. He's not a real fussy guy, but big guy, I like him. I like big husky men, you know? Mm. So I'm not gonna just, oh, squeeze the shit out of me. <laughs> or I can jump up on him and it doesn't bug him. But, um, yeah, I like piggyback rides. <laughs> Who likes piggyback rides? Everybody likes a piggyback ride. So, anyway, uh, he's like a big teddy bear, and I adore him already. Um, I haven't said much about him because I don't want to jinx it, but I really like him. But then there's another Paul that called me today. It's probably my dream life date, but he's not the greatest looking man. But, you know, like I said before, I'm not out for looks, I'm out for what's here in their hearts. And the Paul I'm going out with tonight is really, really sweet. And I really like him. He owns his own business. They all own their own businesses. So, But this guy that called me, he actually emailed me twice yesterday. He owns 140 acres and a nice barn, beautiful home. He owns a ski lodge in Vermont. And I have a date with him next Wednesday. Depending on how my date goes with Paul tonight, I don't know. I'm kind of like one of them girls where if I really like you a lot, I'm going to be dedicated to you. So this Paul beat the other Paul to it. Maybe. We'll see. If not, then I'll be going skiing <laughs> to Vermont. But uh, yeah, he's really sweet. And I talked to him on the phone today. And then right after I hung up with him, it's funny because I have Paul Match. <laughs> and I I put him in as Paul Match too. <laughs> So I almost got the two Pauls mixed up, so that would not have been a good thing, Carrie. <laughs> but it doesn't matter. You know, they know I'm dating, so I'm not going to be exclusive until I feel I should be exclusive, correct? So Mama's just going to go out and play and have her a good old time. All right, you guys, i got to go. I'm just waiting for another 10, 15 minutes, and then I'm leaving. All right, love you guys. Have a great, great thirsty Thursday, because I'm going to have a few. Bye.